Greetings and salutations. I am the Duck of Indeed, of course, and this is Vex on the GameCube. It's time to return to the Summit of the Sages. A silent giant's hand reveals a magic cube. In each side, take a stand and prove you're not a rube. Soul jars. That's what we're doing. Gotta go back into the giant Vex head. That place is super creepy. Let's go inside your own head. If this is representative in any way of what goes on in Vex's head, he's got a dark mind. That noise at the beginning, I don't know if you guys can hear it. It's kind of quiet, but the noise at the beginning when you first get here is so absurdly creepy. That is so creepy. Woo! Woo! Vex! That is gracious! Okay. As far as getting the soul jars, um, or not the soul jars, the shards, there are some here. I don't know if you can leave this place or not, plus it's just, it's difficult enough that it doesn't, it's definitely not worth the risk. Just getting across that gap was, uh, troublesome. So, probably not going to be coming here for shards. I'm sure there's plenty other shards in other places to get. So yeah, we go inside the cube, and I think we use this to turn to different sides. And basically the cube is one room which flips. Uh-uh. <laughs> and the face watches you the whole time, which is extremely creepy. Very creepy. Let's get in there. It's kind of a fun one. Yeah, these we can't get. You gotta get the ones that are upright, obviously, so... Confusing room. Kinda cool, though. There it is. Vex has some really cool, unique stuff. I don't really know why the game was, I think... I thought the game was rated fairly poorly, and I don't know why. Because it's definitely a pretty unique, fun platformer with some very clever stuff, so I don't- I think the game definitely deserved a better rating than it got. Oh, 
I think Vex is a good game. Two out of six! one is that I'm supposed to find this time. Whoopsie! <laughs> Usually climbing upward is your best bet, but where is it though? Ah! Right here. Halfway done. out if you accidentally like uh, go into the same side twice you wouldn't want to do that there's that weird door you certainly would not want to do that because uh, there's nothing for you once you've gotten the soul jar but I am curious what happens if you do that how do you get out and try again hmm I probably want to get over there maybe go. Whoa! I didn't know I was gonna do that. <laughs> well, gotta be a bit quicker. One more! Okay. Uh oh. Don't want to deal with those, those enemies that slow you down a bunch. So, oh, there's a bunch of them. Where is the- there's the final soul jar.
Get it fixed! Get it! <laughs> okay, we're almost there. We did it! We did it! You're so creepy! You're so creepy! I'm creeped out. I don't want to go in his hand. I don't trust it! I don't trust it! Okay, we got it. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and as usual, don't forget to visit us at virtualbastion.com for more gaming goodness. Goodbye, and you're welcome.